is a true story. Okay. I often lie, but I'm not about to. Okay. Uh, I had just got done with a, uh, a meeting with a producer who told me my career was over and that it was done and I should pack my bags and go home. And I kind of stood up to him and said, listen, you know, in this town, actors have second and third acts and, you know, you should mind your fucking manners. And I walk out and then my legs give way because I think maybe my career's over. And I sit down on the, on the, on the sidewalk in, in, uh, on the Sunset Boulevard and I went, wow, maybe my career's over. My phone went, I answered it and it was a number I didn't recognize. And I went, hello, it's, it's Joss Whedon. I went, oh, hi, Joss. He says, you, you, you want to play the Vision in the Avengers? I went, yes, I do. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, when you were first cast as Jarvis, yes. was there ever any semblance of an idea that you might go on to play Vision? Nope. I can tell you exactly. And it's a rather good story. And it just happens to be the truth, which is, uh, uh, you read? Um, I had just uh, had a meeting with a producer who will remain nameless, who told me that my career was over. And he said, you're done, you're done in this town. And I, I was like, you know what? And sort of had this big shouting match at him. And then I walked outside, my legs went away. My legs went, I was like, God, maybe I'm done in the business. And I sat down on Sunset Boulevard on the sidewalk and my phone rang and it was Joss Whedon. And he said, do you want to be the vision in the Avengers? And I went, yes, I do. <laughs> and that was, that's, that's a true story. Yeah, it was a great phone call to get. No. <laughs> and Kevin Feige, uh, he called us both in separately. I thought I was about to get fired. Uh, and he said, he, uh, uh, he, what he pitched was so not what I was expecting. I don't think that myself or Lizzie have ever been more surprised when Kevin pitched the idea to us. I, it was, at, I thought, A1, I thought I was being brought in to be fired. B and two, I thought they were going to let me down, you know, like, listen, Paul. Kindly. We brought you in. Love you, but. <laughs> and instead, what he did was pitch this uh, idea for a sort of six-hour movie. What did you really think the percentage was after you were killed in Infinity War and there was no special tag that revealed that you were not killed? What did you think the percentage was of you coming back? I was sort of very much in the kind of 10 to 15 percent. I, oh. at one point there was going to be a tag um, where you opened a sort of body bag drawer and there was the vision. Then he called me up and said, I, can you come into the office? And you know, when the boss calls you up and your contract's over and he's called you into the office, you kind of know exactly what that's about. And I thought I was going to get kicked off the case. You know, so <laughs> I, uh, I went in and I didn't want anybody to feel uncomfortable. So I said, look, it's been a great run and I love you guys and no hard feelings. And they went, wait, are you quitting? And I went, no, aren't you firing me? And they went, mm, no. And I went, oh, oh yeah, yeah, okay. And then we're going to put you in the show. And I went, I'm in. I got a call from Kevin saying, can you come in and see me at, at, at Marvel? And I went, oh, I'm getting the can. <laughs> We're done with I'm you. Getting, I'm getting the can. And he's going to be nice and, and generous and, and sweet about it, but I, I, I'm getting... And then he pitched this totally bonkers TV show. Did you, Paul, did you think Vision was dead forever? Like, did you think you'd ever be playing him again after phase three? I was about 85% certain I was dead forever. <laughs> I, you know, I didn't, my contract was up. I'd just been killed twice. It felt pretty definitive. And then and then the boss rang up and told me to come in the office and we all know what that means, right? That's 100% why I, I, I can't. I looked at my wife and I went, I think, uh, I think uh, yeah, we've done those expensive vacations. And um, I, I just want to make everybody feel comfortable. And so I said, look, I, it's, if, it's totally fine. I totally get it. It's been a great run and thank you so much. And they went, are you quitting? And I went, no, aren't you firing me? And they went, no, we're going to pitch you a TV show. And I went, oh, I'm in. And, and, and then I didn't listen to the pitch. Thanks so much.